with the woman coming up and down the stairs, you could see her head and her body, but her legs would kind of dissipate. You couldn't really see her moving. And I was here completely alone. It was 11 o'clock at night. I was brushing my teeth. And the shower curtain came flying off the wall. I, all of a sudden, I realized this was not fun and games. This was serious stuff. I was walking up the main staircase, and right in front of me, a ghost slid right in front of me and then disappeared into another dimension. That's what it looked like. So, then sounds, groans, creaking. Um, the, the mansion really howls in the wind, and the wind blows. You hear the sounds. <laughs> People who come in here to visit, some would feel spirits pass through them, especially going into the basement. Do you believe in ghosts? You know, I didn't until I moved there. There was that maid or that older woman who was coming down the stairs constantly. I mean, she would always come down the stairs and she seemed to be in a rush and she seemed to be very sickly and ill and she was wearing an apron. You know how they used to have those little, um, I don't know, like frills on their sleeves and stuff. And she was wearing one of those white old hats, you know, with the frills on it. And her hair was up and she always seemed to kind of be in a rush and she would come up and down the stairs constantly. Like you see her all the time, but I'm thinking, Hey, she's got somewhere to go, so do I. I'm not going to worry about it.